Hello everyone. Welcome to the series of economics in four minutes. This is Dr. Atman Shah. In this video, I'm going to discuss the difference between revenue receipts and capital receipts. Can you subscribe to our YouTube channel to find more videos on economics, SPSS and R Studio. Let's begin with the idea of budget. Budget is the annual financial statement of estimated receipts and expenditures of the government during a fiscal year. So the government budget comprises of revenue budget and capital budget. See this chart. In budget, we have two components, receipts and expenditure. In receipts, we have two categories, revenue receipts and capital receipts. And similarly, in expenditure also, we have two categories, revenue expenditure and capital expenditure. Now, what do we mean by revenue receipts? Receipts which neither create liability nor reduce assets of the government are called revenue receipts. So government receives them in the normal course of activities. Now, what are the sources of revenue receipts? So first is tax revenue, earnings of direct and indirect taxes. So earning of direct and indirect taxes neither create liability nor reduce the assets of the government. Similarly, non-tax revenue. So fines and penalties, interest earning, fees. So non-tax revenue neither creates liability nor reduces the asset of the government. And therefore, tax and non-tax revenue are under the category of revenue receipts. Let's understand the idea of capital receipts. Receipts that create liabilities or reduce financial assets. So they also refer to incoming cash flows. So capital receipts can be both non-debt and debt receipts. What are the sources of capital receipts? So first is borrowings. So borrowings create liability of returning loans and therefore they are under the category of capital receipts. Disinvestment is the non-debt capital receipt sources. So disinvestment is treated as capital receipts because it reduces the assets of the government. And third is recovery of loans. So this is again non-debt capital receipt. So recovery of loans also reduces the assets of the government and therefore it is under the category of capital receipts. So we have two categories, revenue receipts and capital receipts. If you find this video useful, kindly like, share and subscribe to our YouTube channel. Thank you.